Corn School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Headline Amp Fungicide and Pride Seeds. Hi, I'm Bernard Tobin. Welcome to the Corn School. On this episode, we're going to be joined again by Jay Curtis from Kearney Planters. On our last Corn School, Jay shared some tips on how to prep your planter for spring. This time, he offers advice on how to ensure consistent seeding depth and why it's important to zero the row unit before planting. Here's Jay Curtis. Hello. So, zeroing the row unit. Uh, what is zeroing the row unit? This topic has been coming up a lot lately. So, what it is is to see that a T-handle depth setter, typically used on most planters, is it the same from row to row for the same setting of notches? So a, a simple way I just wanted to run through this to give a person an idea how that would work and what it looks like. So to start with, let's, let's relax our T-handle to all the way depth. That means the gauge wheels can come up very high, simulating very deep planting. Just go all the way. Every planter model is different in which way you go. So just go all the way deep with your T-handle. Put a couple of known pieces of wood. Today we're using two by fours. They're an inch and a half. They're not two, they're an inch and a half. We'll put those under the gauge wheels and we'll lower the planter onto it. The seed disc will touch the cement floor, okay? So now we're holding the gauge wheels up an inch and a half. And then we just take our T-handle and we tighten it up to there. Three and three is where I'm at. That means this planter at three and three theoretically is an inch and a half. It will change greatly in soil conditions somewhat, downforce and all those things. So the principle of this is to do this test in all the other rows and see do those T handles also line up with three and three. If they don't, say it's three and four, gets you the same setting or two and three or two and two, well, then you need to understand that when you're in the field, uh, a physical handle adjustment may not be the reality of the depth you're planning. So you can, there's two ways about it. Know how much different to treat that oddball row or fix that oddball row so it reads the same as all the others. <laughs>